say goodbye to weak Wi-Fi connections and hello to this reliable and seamless connectivity that is provided by the Xiaomi mesh system, the AX3000. Designed to deliver lightning fast internet speeds and extended coverage to every corner of your home, this system is the ultimate solution to all of your network problems, whether it's streaming, gaming, or simply just browsing the internet. The AX3000 has got you covered from every angle. With its advanced technology that ensures smooth and uninterrupted connectivity, depending on what sort of pack you get, so we obviously have a two-pack system and it came with the two routers, two power supplies and an ethernet cable. So on the back of the routers, we have a reset button right at the bottom. We have the port for our 12 volt input. We have a WAN port. We have three gigabit ethernet ports and a mesh button. And that is more or less it from the router perspective. So the Xiaomi AX3000 Whole Home Mesh Wi-Fi 6 kit is something that covers your entire home, having 2.4 gigahertz. And on the 2.4 gigahertz bandwidth, it has 802.11ax NBG and is capable of to 574 megabits per second transfer speeds. And on the 5 gigahertz bandwidth, it has 802.11ax AC NA and is capable of carrying 2,402 megabits per second. It has enhanced wireless security with WPA-PSK, WPA2 and the new WPA3 SAE. In each of these routers, there is a tri-core Qualcomm processor with 256 megabytes of memory. And the two pack is ideal for a 4,000 square foot home or a two to a three bedroom home. Each device supports up to 10 devices connected to it. And the mesh system is easy to configure and manage through the My Home app. And it integrates seamlessly with your entire Xiaomi smart home system. Something else interesting with this mesh kit, it has seamless roaming between all the different routers. So whether you are moving between rooms, the transition is seamless so that you're not suffering with a slow internet connected to the far away mesh router. So when it comes to setting up your Xiaomi mesh system, it's as simple as plug, play and run away. So once you take these out of the box, you plug in the attached power and then you can either set it up via the web interface or you could connect to the Xiaomi Wi-Fi uh, from your phone and have the My Home app already installed. After the mesh router has been connected to power, you can either A, plug it directly to your ONT or your internet source and then you would have the mesh uh, router acting as a router itself, or you could plug it to your existing network and then have the mesh system acting as access point throughout your home. So we're currently setting it up through the web interface. If you'd like to see how to set this up through the My Home app, make sure you keep an eye on our socials because we have a video coming there very soon. Once it's connected, you would have to connect to the open Wi-Fi, right? Um, so it'll be Xiaomi router something and then you connect it or you connect to that. So now that we're here, we select which region we're in. I just say, read all the terms and conditions, we select a region. Right. So it will test your network environment. And as I've mentioned now, so you can set it up as a router itself. But what this has done, it's picked up, you know what, it's connected to a pre-existing system. So it says the current mode has been detected and is set to retrieve the, auto, the IP address automatically. And then now the mesh system is gonna act as access point. So click next. You can set up the Wi-Fi name, password, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. 
I'm going to call this a six, seven, eight, seven, eight. I'm going to call this Xiaomi underscore tech scene. next All right so setting up Wi-Fi set up complete Wi-Fi restarting reconnect to get access to the internet what we can do we can go ahead and add a new mesh node to our network so if I click add a mesh node so there's two modes basically a wireless networking mode and a network cable mode so you can connect a cable network the both easy it's simple and they both can actually search for each other and add them or add each other to the network. So you can see that the mesh nodes connected even though they were complaining that they can't see each other. But if I click view full network, you can see there's my gateway and there's my external access point. And just like that. See, this is uh, the Xiaomi Tech Scene Home. And then you can also build this in a way that you can label this as, let's log in. I can label which room that this access point or mesh router is placed. Right, so you can see it's as easy and simple as plug play and time for me to run away. So it's been a little while since we've originally unboxed and spoken about the specs and everything. And we've set this thing up and we've been running it for like about two weeks now. So now we come to talking about who is this actually intended for? I feel this is aimed at people who are not very tech savvy, but want to have good home Wi-Fi coverage, as well as might be moving to something like a smart home because with the Xiaomi My Home infrastructure, everything is done through a single app and you can build your very own smart home. So in that way, it's perfect for anyone who's not tech savvy, but just wants to upgrade and get the best possible solution for their home. So what will it cost you to get the Xiaomi mesh system? So you can pick up a single mesh node for about 1,600 Rand and two mesh nodes retail anywhere between 3000 and 3200 Rand. And then there is also a three pack which is available and that retails for about 4400 to 4500 Rand. So in the two weeks of testing, what have I found to be the biggest benefits of using the AX3000? So firstly, I think it's seamless roaming. So it's virtually every corner of the home is covered and whether you're moving between rooms or whatever, it changes between the, AP, uh, the, the access points so seamlessly that you don't even notice and you always have that strong connection on your device. The second thing is how easy it is to set up and the fact that it's virtually pre-configured straight out of the factory. The final thing that I found interesting was the fact that it integrates with the My Home app and allows you to build the smart home infrastructure without having to go and learn coding and everything like that. And with the Xiaomi Mesh Network, if say anything happens to one of the nodes and if one of the nodes switches off, then what will happen, the entire infrastructure kind of replans itself to accommodate for that missing link. And it still tries to deliver the best or coverage across your entire home. So that is also something very, very cool with the Xiaomi Mesh system AX3000. So now coming down to my personal opinion, Mesh is the way to go. And the AX3000, Although we're saying it's built for people who are wanting a smart home, this is built more to the higher end users. Because now, if we think about it, this gives you up to three gigs worth of wireless speeds on the five gigahertz range. 
And if we think about that now, three gigs, you can cover your entire home with like a hundred devices and still you won't cap off that usage. So it's not just, it may be a lot of devices, but also something that needs that extra bunt of oomph and power, right? There are lower levels of these mesh networks that just give you basic coverage. And that also would speak to the basic individual and not just the higher level guy. So with that being said, this has been an absolute awesome thing to test out. And I mean, the speeds and everything have 100% delivered on their promises. And we've even tested out switching off nodes and noticing how the signal strength kind of dips and partially balances out, even though we just have two devices. Um, we, we've noticed a bit of that. So it's really cool and Xiaomi is building the smart home system. And it's nice to see that they've built their own app to bring everything together. So on that note, what does the AX3000 rate for us? The AX3000 gets an eight out of 10 from me. Um, purely because I'm happy with it. It's at that perfect position, but I, f I, I, I honestly do feel that it is expensive, but the AX3000 range, even if you remember the D-Link version that we reviewed, links up there in the YouTube cards, that too was actually quite expensive. So it is expensive, so it isn't for your average day Joe, but it rates up there with an eight out of 10. On that note, guys, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much to Syntec for sending me out the Xiaomi Mesh AX3000. And guys, if you like this video, you can let me know by leaving a like rating if you did. If you have any questions about this mesh system, make sure you leave a comment down below and we'll be there to chat to you about it. Guys, once again, thank you very much for watching. My name is Prashan and I'll catch you in the next video.